The pimples on my... Oh, no! You want me to pop your... No! Oh, gosh! Oh, that's disgusting, ma'am! <laughs> hey, kids! Grandpa Lemon here, and today I'm playing a game called Real Haircut. Okay. Real haircut. Oh, I guess I'm gonna get to cut some people's hair. Oh, hello, sir. Welcome to my shop. May I say that uh, it's a good thing you're in here because your haircut's awful. Okay. Yeah, let's uh, let's shave off this, um, you know, we, we call this kind of mustache the Chuck Norris, you know? So let's shave that off. All right, already you're looking better. Yep. Ah, uh, you're welcome. Let's see. Did you like your haircut? Okay. Five out of six. Not bad. Thank you, sir. Oh, hello there, young man. Um... Okay. Whoa, oh, whoa. What what's what am I doing? Wait, what the heck? What the heck kind of haircut is this? You want me to shave your chest? You can't do that yourself? Yeah, wh what's that conversation like with your roommate? Hey Mark, uh, I'll see you later. I gotta go get my chest shaved. I, I, it just doesn't make any sense. You know, just go down to Walgreens or CVS, buy some clippers. Oh hello, ma'am. Oh, what's this? Oh, what am I doing here? Tap the sofa. I thought this was a game about haircuts, not interior decorating. The pimples on my... Oh, no! You want me to pop your... No! Oh, gosh! Oh, that's disgusting, ma'am. I don't know why you have an aversion to your own zits, but you can't pay me enough for to do this. Oh! Disgusting. You... Please, get out of my store. I don't even want to see you again. Oh! God, th th this is gross. Guys, here's what I want to... Who makes these games? Who makes these games? More importantly, who talks about... Oh, what kind of game you working on? Oh, it's cool. You you pop pimples, and apparently uh, you rearrange furniture and uh, shave women's mustaches off. I, I, I don't get this game at all. What, what's going on here? This makes absolutely no sense. Oh, look at this. Oh, hello. What trailer park did you come in from? Oh, Lord! How could you possibly let your nose hairs get this bad? Good gracious! Ma'am, you would have to work extra hard to be able to braid your nose hairs like they're cables. Get out of my store! I don't even want your money! Oh! Dear Lord! Oh, hello, miss. You, you, you've got chin hair. And you kind of got the uh, early 2000s emo boy haircut kind of going. All right, so I'm going to remove this wax. Ah, oh, okay. There we go. Got all your hair off. There you go. Now, you, now you're, you're ready for the My Chemical Romance concert. There you go. How was that? Oh, you're going to give me six stars. Great. Be sure to leave a Yelp review. Oh, hello, sir. By the way, I'm loving that suit. Is that from the Dwight Schrute collection? Okay, you just want me to shave it? There we go. I'll just get right in there. And uh, I call this the Wolverine. So well, from now on, your name is Weapon X. There you go. Enjoying the game. Yes, I am. Except not. Except when I'm popping the pimples and, and nose hair. I, nobody wants that. Oh, hello, ma'am. What can I do you for? Okay, hold on. First, I got to get this painting. Okay, um... Match this look. Well, oh, that's that's gonna be tough. Uh, first, I gotta. Ooh, uh, that's those eyebrows. My, are you related to Eugene Levy by any chance? I, I think you might be. But uh, here we go. Just a little trim that up there. And uh, how's that look, ma'am? What do you think? Ready for your date? All right. Making that money. <laughs> Wait, a four? Ma'am, you had two jungles on your face, and I mowed them down for you. Oh, no. Not, no, not again. Buddy, what is wrong with you that you ha need somebody else to professionally pop your zit? Oh, that's disgusting. You are so gross. Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. All right, that'll be $10,000, please. Oh, Lord. Now, you, you should come in for a haircut, not popping your zits. This is a barber shop, not Dr. Pimple Popper on the Discovery Channel. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, hello. Are you a uh, kid and play's father? Look at this. That's an interesting haircut. So, uh, what are we doing here today, sir? A Brazilian blowout? 
What uh, what would you like done? Let me just, uh, I'm going to be honest. I don't even know what I'm doing. Hopefully it turns out good. Oh, look at that. You're looking very spiffy, young man. <laughs> there you go. A four? Ah, get out of here. Ah, you kids. Oh, look at this guy. Did the Joker have a garage sale and you bought that? Oh, that is disgusting. That is the hairiest ear I've ever seen. I, I think he's going to lose a couple pounds after this. Whoa. Can you even hear me, sir? Sir, is the hair blocking you from being able to hear me? That'll be $10. Thank you. Man. What is it with people? They don't know basic grooming skills? I feel like a... Oh, hello, ma'am. Hello. Uh, what, what can I do for you today? Um, oh, I, what, match this look. You want to look like a c cyberpunk person from the movie Hackers? Okay. All right, are you zero cool? Hi there. All right, just going to keep shaving here. Nah. Uh, how's that look? Yeah, you're ready for the Avril Lavigne concert now. All right, let me just taper it off here. And, uh... I gotta go in there, and yep, and just yeah, do a little bit down there, clean that up, shave those sideburns, and uh, yeah, all right, it's looking pretty good. I don't know why you'd want this haircut, but uh, you know, hey, this is America, to each his own. There you go. Oh, now I gotta, now, oh, sorry, put a little on your eyes and your face. I didn't mean to. I, I think those chemicals are sick. Nope, the bottle says the chemicals are very dangerous. You should uh, probably wipe that out of your eyes uh, or else you'll go blind. So let me tell you something. Definitely don't put hair chemicals uh, in your eyes because if you do, you're going to have a real bad time. That, that's all I can tell you. Oh, hey there, sir. My sister keeps saying that I need a bra. What? Well, sir, that's, that's way more. Oh, you got to be kidding me. If you want a bra, sir, go to JCPenney. Oh, my goodness. You, really? You're really making me put a bra, a chest hair bra on you? What, are you going to spring break or something and you want all the girls to look at you? Because they'll look at you, but they're certainly going to stay away. I'll, I'll tell you that much. Oh, my goodness. I, I can't believe I went to cosmetology school for this. This is absolutely ridiculous. Oh, jeez. Look, I mean, come on. Come on. Have you heard of Nair? Have you heard of that? I mean, there's also laser hair removal, you know? You go in for a couple sessions, and then you're as smooth as a baby's bottom the rest of your life. Oh, yeah. Thumbs up. I bet you like that. You look ridiculous. I can't believe I just did that for you. Tell your friends. Oh, gosh. Oh, what do you want? I suppose you want me to, uh... Oh, God, this isn't more zits, is it? Do you have a million... What is that? What's on your face? What am I doing? I guess I just gotta rub this on... Is this Clearasil? What is this? Oh, it's like some kind of mask. Okay, there we go. Oh, you look like Bill Murray after he encountered Slimer in Ghostbusters. Ha, ha, ha. Okay, here we go. I'm just going to apply this avocado mask on you. And uh, let's see. Just let it set. I'm going to peel it off here. And oh, look at that. Much better. Ha <laughs> ha. You're beautiful. Oh, I'm glad you liked it. All right, let's see how much she's going to give me. Four. Hey, I, I, you were looking really bad. Now you're looking a lot better. Oh, look at this guy. More nose hair. Come on. Buddy, how has it been this long since you've had your nose hairs trimmed? I bet this guy was probably sitting there going, man, it's been like, I don't know, four years since I've had a date. I wonder what it could be. I've always thought I've got a sparkling personality, good job, nice car. I've even got a cute dog. Well, there you go. Yeah, now you're on your way to actually having a woman maybe be interested in you possibly. Congratulations. Ah, uh, who's next? Oh, yay, yay. Ma'am, oh, I don't know if you've got enough money for what I need to do to you. But again, I'm not trying to face shame or body shame, but 
Too many of these people come in here. Okay, man, what are we doing today? My eyebrows are the only thing thick about me. Well, I beg to differ, but, uh, you know, that's another discussion for another time. Here we go. I'm just going to use these little guys on your, uh, on your eyebrows. My goodness. Look at all this extra hair. Oh, have you ever thought about donating your eyebrow hair to people that, you know, have, have plucked all their eyebrow hairs out? You should. All right, how's that? Pretty good, right? There you go. Oh, my goodness. These people. Well, I think that about does it for Grandpa Lemon's grooming adventures. I hope you liked this video, because if you did, just give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that bell for the notifications. And kids, just remember, if you ever have really long nose hair or unsightly eyebrows, don't forget to... <laughs> Bye. <laughs>